friends, it's Marie here and I'm back at it again with another video on the same day that I filmed my other one in the same outfit. Yeah. So today I'm going to be talking to you guys about how important it is to get involved on campus. So let's get into it. So getting involved on campus is super duper 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 important. Uh, me being a freshman start of my first semester i didn't really get involved and the start of my second semester i didn't really get involved but now these past two weeks two weeks that we're supposed to be leaving you feel me um i decided i wanted to go <laughs> get involved man and it is so much It's so fun, honestly. Um, these past like couple of weeks have been, I would say, the highlights of my freshman year. Getting involved and um, meeting new people. Before I definitely, um, <laughs> I definitely didn't have like a lot of friends, and I wasn't really meeting a lot of new people, and it really put a negative like. A negative like uh, outlook in my head about um, campus and like the people here and I just like I really like didn't like it was like a solid like 3.756 point no 3.7568 out of 10 before I decided to get involved on campus and now it's like a solid 6.5 that's significant difference for the most part. <laughs> I really enjoy um, meeting new people and finding new things and being in clubs really helps you do that. It really like expands your perspective on campus and it's a great way to meet uh, new friends, meet new people, have new associates and also like give you a more positive outlook on campus life because if you just sit in your room all day you're bored not meet people especially in like corona times you don't really go to class for real and if you do everybody has a mask everybody's like six feet apart so it's difficult to um meet new people and make new friends but if you go join a club so freaking fun so fun to the type of clubs that um, you know you should join you really have to look at your interest and uh, your lifestyle so look at if you want to join like religious clubs if you want to join um, like I guess ethnic um, based clubs or yeah or um, these are clubs based on hobbies or like sororities and fraternities. I don't really do sororities. I'm not that type of person really. So I can't really tell you much about that, but people seem to enjoy it, I guess. Um, it's a way to make <laughs> family connections, I guess. I don't know. They call each other brother and sister. I don't know. But um, <laughs> joining clubs um, based on your hobbies and interest is very like a good thing and um joining clubs based on lifestyle like religious clubs really helps you get um like keep on track to you know learning about um you know the stuff that you're into and stuff that impacts your life in a way um i've joined Chi Alpha, which is a religious club, is very, 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 very fun. I love it so much. I've met so many new people, made so many new connections, and then I've joined a uh, investment club, and it's very interesting. I'm learning a lot about money and things, and I've also met some really cool people there. And then um, I applied to be a global leader, which is um, pretty much like helping international students um was like find their way around campus get um you know 
embedded or whatever. Um, still want to hear back from them. What's up, me? Thanks, you know, I'm cool. <laughs> and then, um, what else? I've joined other clubs, but I haven't really gone to their meetings. And if you're getting involved, also go to the meetings because what's the point of joining the clubs if you're not gonna go to the meetings like me? <laughs> That's me. But definitely go to club meetings, go to clubs. Also, like, even if you're not a part of the club officially, go to clubs just to see like what it's like because that could really help you again meet new people and also discover like new hobbies and interests that you might be interested in so go do that that's always fun and um also wanted to say that if you have like if there's a thing that you're interested in and there's not a club for it of course you can make your own club make your own club that sounds fun i'm thinking about making my own club make your own club because like there's probably a lot of different people on your campus that you'll never know. Like, may have the same interest as you. And if there's not a club for it, make it so you can meet them. Make it. That's fun. It's a way to get social, way to get active on campus. And also, joining clubs, you can get like, what's it called? Cords and stuff. And like, you know, like the little graduation decorations. <laughs> so, that's also a benefit of uh, joining clubs, and also you can put this type of stuff on your resume. Not that I know about them shop clubs and stuff, but <laughs> you can put that type of stuff on your resumes and stuff. And like people, well, you can also gain skills, broskies, leadership skills, teamwork skills, depending on the club, artistic skills, conversational skills. All sorts of stuff. Just learn how to people. You can learn how to people join clubs. And that's really important. So yeah, friends. Join a club. It's so fun. I, I promise you it is so freaking fun. Definitely before I joined a club. I really... <laughs> I really hated this campus. Ah. But now that I'm joining clubs, it's like, whoa, why didn't I do this before? Why did I do this before? It's so fun. So fun. I love it. So go join clubs, friends. The show. So I'm gonna end the video off here. It was nice talking to you guys, and I'll see you in the next one. Um, remember, join clubs, get involved on campus. Don't just sit in your room all day. Be on board with no friends, being a loner. Um, yeah, but if anybody hasn't told you already, you look spectacular today keep doing you hun because you cute you know <laughs> have a good one bye friends